Hey everyone and welcome back to Cybrosis. Today here I am to explain to you guys what Odoo is under 10 minutes. Odoo is a fully integrated software with 100% proven products. You all will be familiar with Odoo because it's an ERP software which simply means enterprise resource planning. So under ERP, we have a lot of modules starting from core modules like sales, purchase, CRM, accounting to HR modules, marketing modules, small modules and so on. So basically talking about Odoo, Odoo has two different versions. Okay, one is the community version and the other one is the enterprise version. So community version is basically the free version of Odoo. So obviously when it's free, there'll be some features which you cannot find in that particular thing okay but that will be found in the enterprise version which is basically the paid version so if you are a developer and you want to explore more in Odoo you can easily get the community version where you can do your further developments and add certain other features which you feel like adding on to Odoo in the enterprise version you will get everything which is basically paid okay so Odoo is very flexible and it has a very scalable and modularity and all such things so you can actually create a lot of things out of this whatever the Odoo is providing you okay so customization is possible over Odoo and it is really easy to implement and Cybrosis is, is one of the partners of Odoo we do customization implementation and you know consultations of Odoo software. So if you have any queries, you can easily come and feel free to contact us. We'll be there and we'll be happy to help you guys. So now let's move on to different modules of Odoo. So talking about the community and ERP, every modules will be there that you can find all these modules in different versions or editions of Odoo, but still some features won't be there. But in community version you can actually find the CRM, the accounting, the sales and purchase and all such things. So when you are a developer working over Odoo, you can use this community version to do the customization and add on features. So you can create small tasks and work over the community version of Odoo. Now talking about the modules and the ERP software, Odoo has modules like sales, purchase, inventory, CRM, accounting and then it has a manufacturing section where it has manufacturing module, maintenance, planning, then it has services, then it has an e-commerce section, it has a website where you can create your website and manage all such things. In the e-commerce also, you can create all the things which is corresponding to the e-commerce. Similarly, it has a POS, it has an HR module section where we can find the employees, the payroll, the attendance and all such things. So that's all about Odoo. Now I'll give you a brief look of Odoo. So here I am with the Odoo interface. Basically, Odoo has a very attractive and user-friendly interface. Okay, so this what you see right in front of you is the different modules of Odoo. Odoo basically has a lot of modules and even in the app stores, some modules that have been contributed by different companies can be seen. And I can proudly say that Cybrosis is one of the highest app contributor of Odoo. Okay, so here you have different modules and if you want to go on and try Odoo, go to your website, not sorry, not the website, sorry, go to your browser and from there you can search for demo.odoo.com. Or else you can go to run boot, choose an instance of any version of Odoo, I mean your desired version of Odoo and from there you can try Odoo. So this is a run boot instance that I have chosen right in front of you. So you have different modules over here like the discus, the meeting rooms, calendar, appointments which are all small modules. So I'll open one among the core modules and show you. This is the sales module. So sales is one among the inevitable part of Odoo. It's one of the you know, most important modules of Odoo. And here in the sales module, you have everything from starting a sale to making the payment, the quotations, the products and everything. So here in the sales, the very first thing which you have is to create quotations. And one more thing to add on, each and every module here is integrated. So that which simply means all the modules are connected to each other. Okay, so you can find sales and quotations and you can see the products here as well as in other modules like the purchase and all. Okay, so the menus will be here. You have a configuration where you have to set all these things and each module has a configuration settings. Not every module, but still most of the module has the configuration settings. Where you can find such uh, check boxes, 
and you can choose whichever thing you want okay so some features won't be available until and unless you select it in the configuration setting so this is the sales module i am not i i mean i really didn't de went deep into the sales module just to show you the interface so that's the sales module you have a dashboard here similarly you have one more important thing which is the accounting module so here you can actually manage everything regarding the accounting like the different types of accounting the customers the vendors that is the invoicing the billing and here you have the reconciliation all such things under the accounting module okay so once you open it itself you will get the dashboard and from the dashboard you will get an idea about what's happening inside the accounting module so i'll take you to one more module or oh, let it be pos so this is the point of sale module okay and here you can see the different point of sales that is different shops that have been opened that have been created in the system so you can easily create point of sale manage the orders and all from here itself so that's the point of sale similarly you have the e learning module okay so this is something related to the website so these courses that you create here can be found in the website okay so that's the e learning module okay then you have a knowledge module which was a new addition in the previous versions okay so then you have a separate area to manage the contacts here you have the contacts module so you can manage the contacts from here okay then you have the employees so that comes in the hr department so here in the employees you can see the different employees employees profile and you can manage everything of the employee regarding the department you will get the reporting corresponding to the employee and under the configuration you have certain other things which are necessary for creating an employee okay so those data can be set up from here and used in the employee creation so that's the employees it's actually a very user friendly thing like you don't have to search a lot to find out what's happening inside here so you can go explore it on your own and then find it out for yourself okay so in our website that is in cybrosis website we have kept a lot of frequently asked questions under which you will get questions according to different modules so through that questions also you can easily get into odu and we are providing blogs as well in youtube we are providing a lot of tutorial videos also which can actually help you a lot to learn odu okay so that's it then you have the plm module and all okay which is the product life cycle management so that's it and then you can see events and for marketing we have the marketing automation the social marketing the sms marketing email marketing and all such things so for the hr section you have the recruitment see here you have the recruitment the referrals and all and two interesting modules that i found here is the lunch and the fleet so you can manage the lunch as well as the fleet of your company also using odu okay and then if you are a manufacturing company and all you will have to manage the inventory okay so for that you have the inventory module over here similarly you have the purchase module to manage all the purchase so i'll just open the inventory this is the inventory where you can actually manage the stock exchange stock moves and all okay so this is basically the ui of odu and if you want to install any new app you can simply go to the apps over here search for the app and install it that's all about odu so it's really easy to use odu so don't worry i'll be back with a very deeper video which will go into each and every module so this is a rough overview of odu the great software so i hope that was clear for you guys thank you so much for watching and this is odu and the 10 minutes